Broadcasting live worldwide. True Grit and Red Dirt Country is brought to you week in and week out by the following sponsors. Thank you very much, Earl's Rib Palace, 25 years and still smoking throughout the Oklahoma City metro area. Six locations that you could go to. Pick one to be one of yours. Find out more information at earlsribpalace.com. Thank you very much, Viridian Coffee Company. Cowboy Brew is the exclusive coffee for True Grit and Red Dirt Country with four locations to serve you in Elgin, Chickasha, Duncan and in Lawton, Billingsley, Ford Lincoln Service Department on the corner of Quarter Park and Trailway, and 82nd in Lawton. Jason and the crew will take care of you no matter the make or model of your vehicle. They have you covered. And if you want to trade up and get something cooler, they also got that brand new Bronco over at the Ford side that you may want to take a look at as well. So that's Billingsley, Ford Lincoln Service Department on the corner of Quarter Park and Trailway and 82nd Street in Lawton. Thank you, Megan. Scott with Bank First, treating you and your money first, always at the 67th Street location in Lawton. Stop by today to see her about personal savings, commercial loans, you name it. She puts you and your money first. Bank First, that is locations on 67th Street in Lawton, Oklahoma, but there are locations virtually anywhere near you throughout the entire state. And welcoming aboard Halftime Sports Bar out of Altus, Oklahoma, going to be your premier venue and also sporting bar where you can check out all the sports. Going to be having a great one this Thursday night. Dallas taking on Tampa Bay. The watch party is already set. Yours truly will be there at around uh, 6 o'clock to kick things off. Hope to see you there at 1613 East Broadway in Altus. Now that I've paid the bills, thank you very much Rachel Lynch for being on the show this evening. Hi! Hey, how you doing, Rachel? Oh, I'm pretty solid. Thanks for having me. Oh, you're very, very welcome. And uh, Rachel was featured in our partnership with Oklahoma Life TV with Danny Carson last week. Great episode, and I'm so stoked to have the opportunity to talk to you. We've had a couple setbacks, had to reschedule, but we finally got you here on the air with 98.7 Red Dirt Rebel. And thank you very much, Danny Carson, for our partnership at Oklahoma Life TV. It was exclusively the women's edition uh, that time, which which is totally awesome. And Rachel, just tell us a little bit about your background and what got you started in this industry. Yes, I can do it. So I grew up in El Reno, Oklahoma. I went to uh, Hinton Public Schools for a long time. Okay, As you can tell by the way that I say Hinton. Mm-hmm. Yep. <laughs> Hinton? Instead yep. of Hinton. Yeah, it's Hinton. <laughs> yeah, it's what you say. Oh, yeah. Hinton people. Yeah, so I, I grew up in El Reno. We went to Hinton for a long time because my dad had a ranch there. Mm -hmm. So, grew up all in the country, and then eventually went to college. I went to OU for a year. I broke both of my elbows skateboarding. Ouch. uh, Both elbows? Wait a minute. Pause. How do you break your elbows? You know, that's the strongest bone in the body almost. Wow. Uh, I broke three of them, actually, because I broke my left one first, and then I broke both of them, like, three months later. Wow. It was nuts. So I went to Redlands in El Reno, and I got my associate's degree. And then I went to UCO in Edmond and got my bachelor's degree in uh, human resources. Okay. Which is pretty cool. I love the day job thing. We all got to have one these days. Uh, Mine is taxes. So I I got my bachelor's degree, and I worked at what I call a big kid job Mm -hmm. for a while. And then I was like, you know what I want to do? I want to play music full time. Okay. And so I quit my big kid job and decided to play music from then on. And it's been almost five years that music has been my full time job. That's good. I'm proud (laughs) that you are healed up with from the elbows for sure. Uh, I know. Oh my God. Yeah. If you do break something, please go to physical therapy because I cannot stretch one of my elbows all the way out. <laughs> Note to self, people. Go to all your PT. I promise it's worth it. I just started playing music when I was at my big kid job at Paycom and I was getting home from those gigs at like 2 a.m., got about three or four hours sleep and then had to go to my real job. Mm-hmm. And I was like, I have to pick. I have to choose. Yeah. And I chose music and it treated me pretty well. Yeah, and then when those situations come about, you just got to make sure that all the ends are met and 
That way you're not living, yep. you know, in the car or and or other weird places. So you made a good decision there. Yeah, it worked out really well. Uh, the pandemic was weird uh, to work in between, it. but <laughs> yeah, you know, mm-hmm. it was nuts though. So not being able to do music out in public and live, uh, I stuck to Facebook live shows, okay. which worked pretty well. And then I started crocheting actually, and I right crocheted on. everything from Harry. Potter characters to shawls to cat couches to snake sweaters, which is not an innuendo. Oh, I made oh, legitimate okay sweaters for for snakes, so they won't be cold. Yeah. Okay. All I right. I mean, then. you gotta help everyone out. That's there's not a problem <laughs> with that. Well, I didn't do any crochet, but I did write some music and, and kind of got, you know, got my music out there, you know, worked on my craft here with doing the shows and podcasting and uh, and things of that nature. Amazing. So, yeah. So the creative outlet, the opportunity to actually just take a breather was a good thing. Yeah. And because a lot. Yeah, it worked out well. Yeah. Because sometimes we're always just go, 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 you know? So, yeah. Yeah. That's the only good thing about this whole pandemic thing. Yeah, that was definitely a plus because I did get to slow down. But on the downside, I only wrote one song during the whole pandemic. Okay. I I expressed my creativity in all the other ways with crochet and my I taught swimming lessons, guitar lessons. And then once we got back into music, you know, being played out in public and everything, I finally started writing some more. But it was such a weird time. All right, then. So what about some musical influences uh, that you've had along the way? I love talking about them. My first favorite band that I was like, I love them. Their music is amazing. I have to go see them. My first favorite band. Their name was Corbin Eldra. Okay. And they were actually an Oklahoma City rock band. And I just, I loved them so much. They were so good. They eventually evolved into a band called The Ugly Suit. And that was pretty cool. But as to like popular music, do you know who they are? Uh, No, I don't. No, I don't. So who, who? With Jack Black. Oh, okay. Tenacious D. Oh, yeah. Okay, Tenacious D. Okay, uh, my bad. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I had a moment there. <laughs> you had a blonde moment. <laughs> yes, I did. They're my favorites. I just love how silly their songs are. That and uh, Bloodhound Gang, Stephen Lynch. They're yes. all uh, com- like comedy musicians. Mm-hmm. So that's cool. I and love that, that. That's my kind of music. Okay. Yeah, I love being able to make people giggle while they're enjoying some music. There's nothing wrong with laughter. Laughter is good medicine for the soul, let me tell you. And uh, we'll be right back here after a word from our sponsors, and then we'll talk about more things happening with Rachel Lynch over the uh, fall and winter months and how you can get a hold of her. You listen to True Grit and Red Dirt Country right here on 98.7 Red Dirt Rebel, and you can listen to us anywhere in the world with the 98.7 Red Dirt Rebel app. We'll be right back. JJ's Pro Audio is a professional sound and lighting company that can do a lot for you, your band, your family, and your business. Find out what services we provide for you and your company today with JJ's Pro Audio. Like us today on Facebook and see what JJ's Pro Audio can do to make your next event one to remember. That's JJ's Pro Audio. Like us on Facebook, send us a message, and get your event booked today. Hey Oklahoma, Earl's Rip Palace has got you covered and they've been doing a great job for 25 years and they're looking to do 25 more. We got six locations to serve you that offer curbside pickup, delivery, and dine-in. Not to mention if you need a catering event handled, Earl's Rip Palace has got you covered. Like us on Facebook and stop by one of our locations today and find out more information on catering options at earlsrippalace.com. And we're back with True Grit and Red Dirt Country right here on 98.7 Red Dirt Rebel. And uh, my friends with Halftime Sports Bar want you to watch one of the biggest games of the year. Halftime Sports Bar is going to proudly present the watch party for Dallas Cowboys taking on the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Dak Prescott, Tom Brady, who will make it to the bragging rights stage early on in the NFL season. Find out Thursday night. Watch party starts at 7, 
Kickoff is around 7.20 on NBC. And uh, we're back right with Rachel Lynch. And uh, we've had a good conversation getting to know a little bit about Rachel's background, the musical influences. Now, Rachel, what are we doing over the winter and fall months as far as current projects and future projects? So uh, the band has a couple shows coming up, which is so much fun. They're called Rachel Lynch and the Day Drinkers. I don't know if you're a... Uh, a day drinker sometimes, but you know, you could always be. I definitely can be, yes. Oh, who can't? So the day drinkers, we have some stuff coming up. We have, we're playing at Pride in Oklahoma City, which is gonna be so much fun. We played two years ago before the pandemic and that was a blast. And we're playing at Wardstock on September 18th, which is, uh, if you've ever been to Vices in El Reno, that's their yearly anniversary party. So what is your social medias or the usual suspects, as I like to call them, so people can get a hold of you? Because that's very, very important. <laughs> so you can go to Facebook and just type in Rachel Lynch and the Day Drinkers. You can find us through there. On Instagram, we are the.daydrinkers. Or you can find me personally, Rachel Lynch Music. Or go to our website, www.rachellynchandthedaydrinkers.com. We have a lot of fun. We've always, always got stuff going on. See everybody, there you have it folks, Rachel Lynch and the Day Drinkers. Everywhere that you can mm-hmm. possibly stream music or find out social media, Facebook, Instagram, and a .com, ladies and gentlemen, other known as the yeah. World Wide Web. <laughs> We are everywhere. <laughs> oh, I was just going to say, I'm kind of excited because I'm finally, I've gotten requests for this before, but I'm finally making a lyric booklet with all sorts of art in it and the lyrics to all of my songs. And it's going to be really neat. I can't wait to get it out. All right. So you're going to do a lyrical book with all types of stuff. You know, a lot of people have been doing that, you know, writing down their lyric sheets and, and then offering it to fans yes. as well. So that's, that's really cool that you're doing that, Rachel. That's awesome. I can't wait. And I always have the best artists that do all my, uh, like my t-shirt designs, and CD designs, and this one too. So it'll be neat to, to see it in its entirety. All right then, Rachel. Well, thank you very much for being on True Grit and Red Dirt Country, getting to know you a little bit. And I look forward to seeing you at one of your shows really soon. And thanks for taking the time to talk. Thank you so much. And thanks, Danny, for having me too. I appreciate it. All right, then. This has been Rachel Lynch from Rachel Lynch and the Day Drinkers. Make sure you hit her up on all her social suspects, as I like to call them. And uh, when we come back, we'll have (laughs) more great music that is coming your way right here on True Grit and Red Dirt Country, right here on 98.7 Red Dirt Rebel. We'll be right back.